Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Exotic Astrology and the other day somebody had asked me a question Oh my god, I always end up choosing terrible people in my life either it is love, romance, friends, business partners, acquaintances everybody is terrible around me Why do I always end up choosing the wrong kind of people? So how do we make the right choices in life? Because our the association with who we are surrounded is very important because it is said that you are the average of five people who you associate with should i repeat you are the average of five of those closest people who you associate with your mother father your husband your wife or whoever they are and your friends of course maybe your company colleagues also so today we will discuss in short hopefully <laughs> on how to choose the right people and how to not end up creating more trouble for ourselves because they say there are already 99 problems don't be the hundredth one should i repeat there are already 99 problems don't become the hundredth problem did i say it right yes maybe <laughs> all right so if you're new to the channel and if you have not yet subscribed then please subscribe to it and if you like this video click the thumbs up and share it with somebody who always keeps telling you I always make the wrong decisions and if you want a consultation regarding your life or your horoscope or you want to talk to me in general regarding some placements or your marriage or your love romance or your career or your health or your spiritual life then you can go to my website and book a reading with me you will find the link to the website in the description of this video below all right and before I say should you write it in the comments i will not say today no no let me say god is there with you all the time just look to him and he will help you find the right people okay so now there's a saying that you don't attract what you desire you attract who you are should i repeat you don't attract what you desire you attract who you are what does this mean this means that the way you are you will also be attracted to the uh, to other people who are like you and the way you are other people will be attracted to you that way it is like a synchronous relationship so a person who likes to drink will only make friends with another person who is like who likes to drink a person who likes to smoke will only appreciate and like the company of people who are smoking now that does not mean that he may not have people who are uh, religious or who watch tv or who are watching football but he will definitely go and find somebody who is smoking because he finds uh, a nice company there because they send up birds of the same feather flock together <laughs> so what happens basically is when we indulge in some wrong habits it all starts from there the point is there people don't go to the point People will say, oh, do this, do that, so many things they will say, but they will not catch the point. The point is, when we are having wrong habits in our life, then what happens is, we start projecting those things as very valuable. So, for example, somebody is uh, watching pornography, for example, or somebody visits prostitutes. Then that person, the, the only delightful thing that the person uh, thinks about 24 hours is the... Uh, body of the opposite sex so whenever he sees the body of the opposite sex he thinks oh this is like a jalebi this is like a gulab jamun this is god has made this person for me to enjoy <laughs> because his habits are forcing him to be like that so first of all we need to ensure that we cultivate the right habits in life because if we don't do that then our projection will be something which is not very good for our life and then our frequency will be of that uh, wavelength and then we will also interact with people in that frequency and then we will attract we will get attracted to others and then they will also get attracted to us that way so the thing is we have to improve our habits unless we do that nothing will happen we will keep attracting people who will come and destroy our lives so many people i know that when they go to engineering colleges in the first year so many boys especially 
they get spoiled totally i have seen in the year 2010 so many of my friends in india in south india when i was in srm university chennai software engineering i stayed in a building known as staff quarters so there i had seen so many of my friends my god they used to go to some people and they used to say oh today ek din bhook lag kuch nahi hoga only once you try to smoke nothing is going to happen you see everybody smokes these days it's cool basically so they did it once they did it twice they did it thrice and then that's it the rest is history very soon they will become pages in history books hopefully <laughs> hopefully they do something good in life but the problem is that we we don't understand see bad habits are like we don't understand that we are falling in the trap that's the trap actually that's the biggest trap that we think that oh nothing is happening everything is fine so when a person starts indulging in wrong habits he or she will never feel that that is wrong that's the nature of sin it convinces you that you are right should i repeat the nature of sin is it convinces you that you are right a person who eats meat you go and ask the person my dear sir why are you killing this animal why are you eating meat go and ask to any person who eats meat he will tell you oh what's the problem there's no problem you see this is just food if you don't eat them they will eat you how will you get protein god created animals for humans to eat so these kind of things they will tell you and not that they are pretending they are totally convinced of what they are saying is right 100% so because w- w- what happens is when the mode of tamo guna and rajo guna is very strong it gives you a lot of uh, negat- negative convincing power which means that you totally believe you are right you go and tell to a person who is smoking so why are you doing why are you damaging your life then that person will say oh what's wrong there's nothing wrong you know smoking has other benefits i know yeah it is problematic i know but it's not a big deal you know i i am not a addict actually i don't i am not going to have cancer i have no problems i am a healthy person <laughs> you will never find any person who smokes or drinks will say yeah yeah man i know it's bad but i still do it you know it's difficult actually blah 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 no sometimes they may feel like that but majority of the times at least in my experience i have seen they are overly glorifying that Sim- uh, sim- similarly a person who goes to clubs yes drinks parties enjoys you go and ask him why are you wasting this valuable form of life which this uh, scripture say atha to brahma jigyasa enquire about the absolute truth and spend your life in spirituality there are 8.4 million species my goodness and out of that scripture say that the human birth is very 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 rare <laughs> lord krishna says in the gita bahunam janmana mante gyanavan mam prapadyate vasudeva sarvam iti samahatma sudur labha bahunam janmana mante after many 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 <laughs> lifetimes bahunam janma naam ante after <laughs> gyanavan maam prapadyate one understands that i am the cause of everything vasudeva sarvam iti that krishna that vasudev krishna is telling vasudev is he himself right he is the son of vasudev so that i am the cause of everything i am everything basically i am everything doesn't mean that uh, god is every, everything in the way that oh this this is my this mobile is god not this laptop is god you are god i am god no that god is the enjoyer creator and proprietor of everything vasudeva sarvam iti samahatma sudurlabha such a mahatma is sudurlabha sudurlabha means very 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 rare so among the 8.4 million species of life it is very 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 difficult it requires a very high level of karma to get birth in a human body why so that you can stay in america or here in germany no that's not the reason the reason is that only in human body you have the chance to obtain spiritual perfection that can also happen in animal bodies if god wants but generally it's not the case you will never find a dog or a cat or a sheep or a horse coming and coming and discussing with another 
एनिमल दैट हे टूडे इज एकादशी वी नो वी शुड फास्ट ऑन एकादशी टूडे इज जन्माष्टमी वी शुड फास्ट ऑन जन्माष्टमी देर एनिमल्स हैव नो इंक्विजिटिवनेस फॉर गॉड बिकॉज दे डू नॉट हैव दैट लेवल ऑफ इंटेलिजेंस टू फैदम द आइडिया ऑफ अ कंट्रोलर दे आर ओनली कंसर्न विद ईटिंग स्लीपिंग मेटिंग एंड डिफेंडिंग दीज फोर एक्टिविटीज बट वैन ह्यूमेंस आर ऑल्सो डूइंग द सेम एक्टिविटीज eating yes going on restaurants i know people who are staying in cities like pune bangalore delhi mumbai chennai the only thing you see in facebook is every weekend they are going to a different restaurant yes so the animals are doing the same thing today they are going to this tree tomorrow to that place so when they are doing that then eating sleeping yes filled instagram is filled with photos my god oh my god i slept for 8 hours 12 hours 14 hours in yes eating sleeping mating having sex with the opposite sex yes that's rampant in kali yuga what to speak of change the topic <laughs> hopping from one person to the other to the other to the other trying different ways of sexual ex- experimentation and sexual exploitation my god eating sleeping mating defending defending means you are trying to defend yourself yes <coughs> cut throat competition so animals are also doing these things so when we human uh, human beings are also doing only these four activities then the scriptures say the human being is not a manushya actually he is a dvipada pashu dvipada pashu means two legged animal animals have four legs and humans who only do these four activities eating sleeping mating defending are known as dvipada pashu means uh, that person is simply an animal but he has two legs basically animals have four we have two wow <laughs> one who is not enquiring about the higher truth is not actually a human being whoever that person is it doesn't matter he is the president or he is uh, anybody i mean it doesn't simply doesn't matter so when we do not enquire about the higher truths we then glide down into these animal activities and then we get into bad habits and then our mental setting becomes like that because we start finding happiness and shelter in those things and then we also attract the wrong kind of people so that is the secret because a person who is spiritual in nature spiritual doesn't mean he's just thinking that maybe he's spiritual but he's actively doing uh, spiritual activities that's the meaning he is chanting mantras getting up early in the morning he is going uh, he is reading the scriptures he is trying to understand what his guru is telling he is trying to uh, eat good food vegetarian food preferably then he is also trying to visit the holy places understand tatva jigyasa he is interested in that he is only interested in one thing and when the person is like that then he will also attract those kind of people in life like for example i know many of my god brothers who if they go to a material mundane setting they'll be sitting lonely there why because everybody else is discussing oh who is having an affair with whom who got the next promotion who is uh, how beautiful is the girlfriend of this person how handsome is the husband of this lady yes all the useless rubbish garbage of this world they are going on discussing and then they my god brothers they will just go and sit because they have nothing to talk <laughs> because they are thinking of the absolute truth athato brahma jigyasa they are trying to think that how can i be god conscious during this party also <laughs> so you become an alien you see you do not have any friends then yes many people have messaged me that after seeing your videos we have become aliens in the society we do not we have lost all our friends we have given up their association and we are just sitting alone idol we don't have any friends you see <laughs> no don't worry you can uh, pray to god that he gives you the association of like minded spiritual people so when you become more strong internally spiritually then you will attract the right kind of people and this is true for anybody then he will understand people very fast like this otherwise he will also become in that category now there was one girl once she had told me that she was in a relationship with a man from last uh, i think 6 7 years and then now she's still not sure should she marry this person or not and then i'm like 
what the hell are you doing in the relationship then <laughs> and even if she wants to marry the other person doesn't want to marry her so you see this is what is going on oh i want to marry you you don't want to marry me i want to marry somebody else love triangle you say useless rubbish garbage of this world <laughs> So if you want that you don't become a victim to all this then you have to inculcate spiritual practices in your daily life okay and you can chant vishnu mantras that's fantastic as soon as you get up in the morning you can chant any vishnu mantra preferably you can chant om namo bhagavate vasudevaya you can also chant om namo narayana you can also chant that you can also chant so many mantras are there my god vishnu mantras those mantras you can chant and then every day you can read one shloka from the gita or from the bible or from the quran recently a muslim girl she had messaged me i was amazed that she said that no oh, uh, although i'm born in a muslim family but still i'm watching your videos and uh, i am i have become a vegetarian and i have inspired my family members also to become vegetarians i was like wow <laughs> i i forgot her name but if i would have remembered i would have also told about her in uh, i would have taken a name but unfortunately i don't remember and then there are so many uh, people from Bud- buddhism christianity sikhs hindus so many people they m- they message me that after seeing your videos we have given up meat we have given up alcohol we have given up cigarette we have given up pornography wow <laughs> and then i was like wow thank god something is happening at least so when we cultivate the right desires we will have the right attitude and then we will attract the right kind of people no nonsense no beating around the bush as in asmis they say na sale bara kubwa just hovering oh yeah i have seen people very superficial these days there was one girl who i knew i mean i still know her <laughs> anything anybody anybody's name you tell her she will say oh yeah 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 i know that person you know he or she is my best friend actually she has around 40 to 50 best friends and still she is lonely you know watching game of thrones watching big boss going to the company bitching about other people and it's like gone case <laughs> so so many best friends you see all superficial contacts but when we are becoming more and more genuine inside then we will not make superficial contacts we will make concrete contacts which will remain for a lifetime like the friendships which i had made in the year 2010 with my god brothers they are still lasting and they will last till the time i breathe <laughs> in this planet and till the time they are breathing i will also be uh, in contact with them and with my gurus and with my other seniors such a blessing it is to have so many people you see otherwise then I have to run behind a lady. Oh, this is a chocolate for you, you see. Oh, I have to message a lady. Oh, you are looking very beautiful. You are looking very charming. You are looking very cute. You are looking very nice. And then the lady will maybe reply to me after 24 hours. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you. <laughs> then I also have to sit and keep pursuing uh, a lady, you see. These kind of things I also have to do then. I have be- because I have no option because I have to stay with somebody, right? so then i will also start degrading then i will also complain oh this girl used me i got used by this girl blah 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 and so on you see i attract the wrong kind of people so then these things happen okay but when you choose the right kind of people who have the right kind of habits then you do not end up being in trouble your life improves overall and that is very important that we also choose the people who are having good habits but for that we ourselves have to have good habits otherwise it doesn't work you see all the material world the entire material world is focused on the externals yes marry a person who is rich who is looking good who is affluent who is influential who is attractive who is charismatic who is charming but nobody talks of what about you my dear sir <laughs> however the other per- person is in, in in a relationship any kind of relationship but if you yourself you are a disaster then you will end up destroying the life of that other person also okay so save yourself charity begins at home do spiritual practices and in the weekends try to visit a 
spiritual community which is near to your place in the weekends or in the weekdays also if you are fortunate if you have time from your company then in the morning you can listen to bamba samhita you can listen to vishnu sastranam shuklam varadaram vishnum shashi varanam chatur bhujam prasanna varanam dhyayet sarva vigno pachantayet <laughs> or if you want you can also listen to ब्रह्म संहिता वेणु कनंदमरविंद दलाय थाक्षम बरहावत समसी बुधसुंदरंग लक्ष्मी सहस्रशत संभ्रम सेव्यम गोविंदमादिपुरषम तम हम भजा यदा सकलेन्द्रिय वृत्ति मंती <laughs> i can go on and on and on with the brahma samhita but due to the interest of time i will not speak much and there are so many chopais you can read the ramayana you can read the shrimad bhagavatam you can read the first verse of the shrimad bhagavatam what is that write it in the comments om namo bhagavate vasudevaya janmadyasya yaton vaya ditaratas charthe shubhigya swarat तेने ब्रह्म हृदयादिकव मुह्यूरया तेजो वारिमृद यथा विनिमय त्रिसर्गो मृषा धाम स्वेन निरस्तकुहाक सत्यम परामधीम यू कैन रीच स्क्रिप्चर्स लाइक दि भगवदगीता इन दि मॉर्निंग यू कैन रीच श्लोका महात्मास्तु मं पार्थ दैवीं प्रकृतिमाश्रित भजती अनन्यमनसो ज्ञावा भूतादिम व्यय सो मेनी श्लोका जैसे कामेश क्रोधेश रजो गुण समुद्भवा सो मेनी श्लोका जाते यू कैन गिव गो यू कैन गो ऑन एन ऑन रीडिंग यू सी एंड यू कैन ऑल्सो राइट इट इन द कमेंट्स दैट दिस श्लोका हेल्प मी ओके एंड देन whenever you meet people around you can keep discussing you can say hey listen come here i you sit down i will tell you you know i read this shloka krishna was telling like this <laughs> and then if that person is not of your frequency you will say hey i don't like all this you know you go i want to go to the mall i want to go to the, to the club i want to meet this girl that's it bye bye <laughs> so people will throw you out of their lives if they are not in that frequency which is very good for you actually because then you will not waste time with them okay and you will also throw them out of your life it has happened with me many people have thrown me out of their lives because whenever i meet them i keep talking of the scriptures you see then they are like ah. <laughs> can you not talk of politics sometimes or can you not talk of big boss you know there's a new season of game of thrones coming let's talk on that my dear sir but i'm like <laughs> no i can't okay so there you go be a strong person inside cultivate the right desires good habits and then by that you will attract the right kind of people okay and other people will also attract you <laughs> there you go if you like this video click the thumbs up and share it with somebody who is interested to know how to cultivate good habits and attract the right kind of people in life and if you are new to the channel and if you have not yet subscribed then please subscribe to it and if you want a consultation regarding attracting good or right people in your life then please go to my website and book a reading for relationships or career or health or spirituality anything whatever you desire okay until next time wish you good luck bye bye see you